all of you welcome back to yet another video so currently i'm working on a solana project and this project is quite different with all the dab which you will find which run on solana chain even this product is very rare on the ethereum ecosystem so i thought let's talk about it because you have to know that what kind of project so if you start working in the company if you start taking freelancing project that the client can demand any type of project and you have to fulfill that requirement so this is one of the project we have got so i thought let's share with you all so this particular project is a nft plus decentralized exchange plus crypto wallet inbuilt what i mean by that crypto wallet inbuilt so this particular clients tell us to build a build a dapp which can facilitate the nfts and the decentralized exchange but they want the wallet inbuilt in the dapp so right now if you want to interact with any blockchain or perform any transaction in the solana ecosystem or in the ethereum ecosystem we have phantom wallet we have metamask we have multiple wallet providers which we install in the browser and we communicate with them but the client requirement is that they want invil wallet in the dapp so if the user wants to make any transaction it's not going to open the metamask it's going to perform the transaction internally and everything will happen internally including the account creation transfer fund buying selling that's all will happen internally without touching the external wallet so currently we are working on it and i thought let me show you that how you can create the private key and the secret key for your wallet for the client so if anybody wants to use it and they going to use definitely the dapp so we'll provide an option for creating account or if they have their own account they can simply import the private key and they can perform the transaction so let me show you how you can create the private key and the secret key in solana blockchain so this is the code which i have written i'm just a boilerplate which i want to show you that what exactly you need it so the only thing you need is this particular library and that is enough for creating wallet private key so come back to the package json file you will find that right now i'm working on the logic so it's going to have a like icu kind of thing that's why i'm using this particular library i hope you guys are familiar with this solana spl token and all the libraries exist which allow us to communicate with the solana ecosystem metaplex we have multiple thing but we're going to focus on this particular library which allow us to create the token sorry private key and secret key so i'll come back to the my script so here we have imported the library which we are using here we have this particular function which allow us to create the key pair so this particular function is very important is going to generate the key pair for both public key and the secret key so let me simply 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 comment this all and let me show you when i'm going to execute this function what i will get so this particular function going to generate a random public key and secret key which i'm going to simply expose in my terminal so let me open it up and i have to simply run the command node solana js hit enter and it's going to generate me this particular key here we got this unt 8 32 bytes and this is one is the 62 bytes but you cannot able to import the key in this way so if i simply copy the entire secret key and try to come back to my phantom wallet you will see that it will not work so here we have the option if i go back to the add accounts here we have multiple option to import our account you can do with the phrases you can do with the private key and you can do all multiple way or you can even create one so i'll go with this one and if i paste here this is not supported this is not supported so we have to simply convert it into a 62 byte string so we can able to import into our phantom wallet so i'll come back in my code and this is what we have so for that we use this particular function so here first thing we have to convert that into a string so let me comment this one and this is what we got here we got it let me comment this all actually let's bring this all and let's bring all of that and here we have what so what we are using we are doing simple work we are taking this buffer from in that we are passing the secret key so is going to convert into base 64 i hope you know what is base 64 if not then let me know in the comment section go and do a little bit of research so we are simply converting it and here we are returning the public key and the secret key and we are using the same both methods okay so this time if i'm going to simply run this particular command is going to give me a proper formatted address which i can import it so i'm going to simply comment this clear my terminal and i'm going to hit the command one more time and here we got it so this was the key generated by the method we have used but we are using the buffer and we are simply converting into base 64 so this become our public key and this become our secret key so all you have to do is to simply copy this one and you can simply come here import key and paste you can see it's automatically detach like 9 yw and that's what we have here 9 yw you can simply give whatever name you want so i'll say g g for a time being i can call this import and here we got the wallet up and running and you can start claiming for the airdrop 
you can do that so this is how you can create and generate the wallet so this is how you can generate your public key and secret key for solana ecosystem i hope you guys have got familiar if not i would come i would suggest you to come and check this particular package check the modules that what are things we have in that this will help you a lot if you really want to work in the solana ecosystem so that's the only thing from my own hope you guys have liked it if you want more video like solana then do let me know in the comment section and definitely i'm going to build a complete video on this particular project once we complete so just give time it's going to take a little bit time so once we'll complete the project i'm going to give you the complete demo that what exactly we have built and you will take the idea from it so that's the only thing from my end i hope you guys have got an idea that how you can generate it so use this library call the method call this one then simply convert it and you got your private key and secret key so that's the only thing from my end if you have any question in doubt let me in the comment section i'll definitely try to help you in that have a wonderful day bye, -bye.